Hello boys, my name is Kuyoshi and welcome back to my 100% playthrough of uh, Hyrule Warriors Definitive Edition for a Tunnel Switch. We're probably going to change uh, playthroughs because I've been really tired of doing this over and over again, but anyways, we left off doing Gan's Fury Mode and we did it down to basically all, all but mm, one mission and we'll in a different video, take out that mission and also introduce ourselves to Cuckoo Mode, which is basically a mirror of that same mode, but uh, nearly 25% as difficult. And we'll only do the 5000 KO one just so we can get Cuckoo some early game experience, and then yeah, that's about it. But, anyways, we are gonna be playing a Twilight map today. There's no effects for some reason. Find the key to a balanced attack. Huh? With Twilight Field, um, there are a lot of modes I want to get to uh, as quickly as possible. So I'm going to just uh, go towards uh, the enemies uh, on the far left side as soon as possible. So that's where the dividing missions are and there are some really good divine missions you can use to get some experience. Oh wow. I don't know what that was, but it was pretty easy. I don't know what this is, <laughs> what this is but it's definitely not as bad as the Gan stuff I've been doing. That's for sure. Yes, I'm trying to. Alright. Okay, so they just heal constantly, so you have to use specials on them then. There we go. I thought it was going to be a much quicker mission, but whatever. Oi, I knew you could do it. If I was using a like this, it would be a lot easier, but I have to use Toon Link for the... Alright, so I have to make sure that gets collected first instead. There's only one black there on this, so it's not easy by any means. 
This is one of the original maps beside both Adventure and Master Quest map that was in the Wii U version as well. Though in uh, 3DS they added a lot more stuff to do, in my opinion. <sighs> I can't wait to be done with Gan's Fury Mode, because once I get that and Cuckoo's Fury Mode done, it's going to be nothing but Adventure Mode, and yes, that is part of 100%. Show no fear to the enemies of Twilight. Limited Midnight. Yeah, that clearly makes sense. This is the Realm of Twilight, so of course we're gonna have to use Midnight quite a bit. Uh, I'm gonna do Pencil 2 on this. And that's it, and we'll go straight into it. And then look for my, uh, I'd while I wait. And yes, it's like, uh, 8k or something. Sometimes it does take forever to load. Whoa, excuse me. So this one is N6. Okay, we have to KO Southfield Keep here. Uh, another traitor one or uh, bomb two one? It's bomb twos. Or no, it's powerful enemy forces actually. Well, we have to KO these enemies kind of quickly, duh. Uh. Okay, yeah, I know. That's a big boy bowling. Okay, good. I follow the strongest side, that's all I've ever known. Okay, good. Most of that was just for uh, invincibility. So I have to take out Southfield Keep, but I also need to support Zelda's advance as well so that we can create a magical circle to kind of slap the enemies around with. Yeah, I don't know. I honestly don't actually care about him. He's way too far away for me to save him, so I assume... <laughs> I got their phrases just quit whining. <laughs> That's exactly what I feel like. Give me a minute. Okay, guys, I'm back. Sorry, I actually forgot to pause it, but I'm back now. 
So, uh, now we're going to, uh... Okay, good. Oh, we have to kill the guy on the bottom first. But we also have to kill the guy on top to stop his attack. Okay, now we need to kill Southfield Keep and the boss to finish this off. Alright. got rid of the stupid summoner which will prevent the dark lissables from appearing he straight up vanishes wow okay now let's kill all these captains raid captains and raider captains as well I know I can go straight for the boss but because of a lot of need for materials I feel like killing the captains as well is still a good idea so I'll take those guys out and now I'm gonna just run straight for the boss there's not a lot I could have done here to make it faster yeah I could have been more aggressive but I'm trying to a rank all the missions so I need to at least kill some troops Speedrunning this particular part of the game might actually be kind of tough as a result. Since I have to get A rank in every single mission, it just gets kind of annoying. Yeah, I don't care about that dark nut. He can die up all he wants. No, his big attack uh, just yeets an enemy to the side. Alright, there we go.
All right. All right. Half a warp pyres assist on a try adventure app. Using him skill A will be the key for smooth adventure. You'll not be able to use red warp portals. Win the battle to turn the portal green and gain access to its warping powers. Then use the ukuku to warp to different areas. There's no way to get this other thing done right now. Alright, let's just do this. Alright, right, we need to protect a bomb too. I forget what that actually means. I think it's as simple as just, well, falling with it, but if there's more than one, then that changes things a bit. This is another new one that we don't know about a lot. Okay. Need to kill this Dinoflas real quick. Alright. Alright. Jeez, I uh, yeah, I'm like 15 feet across to that. Alright. Oh, he's advancing directly to it. So yeah, it is just kill the captains, basically. Can't leave a single one alive, otherwise they'll be destroyed a bomb chew very quickly, otherwise. Good. Oh, now its speed went up. That helps out a lot. All right, good. We did it. <laughs> My gentleman is still pumping. <laughs> okay. There we go. And yes, this is the last set uh, that I have to do. Can I use you? 
reasons why not. Okay. We're using Voga again. I just pick whoever is closest. Cannot let Foga flee, I know that much. I don't need a lot of Lana forces. We're gonna defeat, uh, though, I, well, I don't need Sia either, unfortunately. So yeah, I guess I will just be doing it. Good. Don't panic, I have this under control. I've recently got a lot of Sia materials, that's the only reason why I'm doing this, because I do not need Sia materials, so I'm just doing that. Okay, now they return. Alright, now we have to take uh, both commanders out. Okay, and she is summoned to Goma. Which we're gonna try our best to ignore and... <laughs> I, I, I kinda joked. Okay, that takes care of Goma. I guess since we got a fast attack against him, I just decided to KO Goma because, well, here's a little secret. I actually need a lot of his materials, and I do need a lot of Link materials. So, yes, I picked Link as the commander because I want his materials. Alright. Kinda s Hey, how dare you slap my friend around, Link. I just wanna take you out. Another easy mission. I'm not ready to see what the hard version of that will be like, though. Probably involves building towards and killing all enemies to ultimately work your way to the commander. Oh, if this was a rare game, Zelda would work with uh, Lana and Link normally, but <laughs> uh, I get to do whatever I want, so if I want, Fate can decide to have me do other stuff. I did this one because there's an item here that we want. Uh, let's do this one. Did I actually pick? Yeah, yeah, yeah. This is the right one. Okay, this one is defeat the disorderly faces, which is really weird. Let's 
So now we could get to K5 if we want to. But we still need the item to use that, otherwise it won't work. Oh, jeez. What am I doing? Okay, I need a thousand KOs and that's it. Okay. Oh my goodness, this Iron <laughs> Thief again. Oh, it's a traitor one. Turned into Lynx forces. Ooh. Oh my goodness, and now Diaphos are appearing as well. Jeez, that... They're already trying to destroy my base. My goodness. Well, it looks like I'm gonna have to do a lot of running around again. Okay. Oh, Sia's own forces are turning against her. Okay. I thought that was, like, the other thing. But, uh, it's this one. Instead... Excuse me. Yeah, I know. I'm trying to kill you right now. Yeah, I'm I'm doing that. I just finished it. Defeat Dartnet before Sheets Fortress turn traitorous. Okay, we're gonna do that right away. Good. Alright. Well, I don't know what else to do right now, but I think I need to start by KOing these guys first. Look at all the captains everywhere just dying. There's not really any true way to know who to save and who to leave. Seriously, you're dying down here? Actually, it might be farther back than I thought. Well, we're gonna just KO all the keeps, I guess. I don't know what else to do. The problem is, I haven't done a lot of these missions at all. This is where my blindness starts really kicking in, so... I kind of have to just do stuff before... Oh, now I have to go down. Okay, well, I don't want to waste this. We're gonna use a couple specials to try and kill them. I'm just killing the Torsus as I go down with specials. So I can just drop a quick special to kill them and then just leave afterwards. Now we need to kill the start nut. All right. Followed it again. All right. This does give us a badge, Lada, because we certainly need one with all the opponents we have to face here. Alright, you know what? Yeah, I'm gonna come right there and just, uh... Oh, they actually practically did this themselves. I always feel as sad when I come here and they're literally dying to, like, pins, because that's, like, sad. It just shows how bad the AI is, but... 
If it's captains, it's a little bit different. Okay, they killed the one that I weakened. Uh, I thought we were supposed to just defeat the captains to wear out the commanders. Now we have to just get a both commanders dead. Jeez, that animation started so quickly, I didn't even expect it. Yeah, I don't care, you're very far away. I'm just gonna kill both commanders as fast as I can. There we go. I back is so I could use a good stretch. Ellie. Yeah, <laughs> so yeah, Anking. I think as he is uh level three sword here. Yeah, I don't care about them. I'm just gonna go for a link here. And still not dead. Now he's dead. Alright, now this other commander. And now we don't have to deal with the yellow troops anymore. That makes it pretty easy. And our guy should hopefully hold them off now. We could just go straight up. But uh, my patience for you is run out. Oh yeah, that's right, because we're using Alana. Oh, she's using a different weapon. That is not her staff weapon. That is a completely different CEO weapon. She's actually mimicking Lana's attack. For some reason. She normally uses the staff, so that's kind of awkward. Yeah, this will smile on her victory. Indeed, Cheek. Alright. This unlocks teleporter number one. Unfortunately, I do believe I have to go for most of the, since we don't get an ukuku until much later. Which is a bit annoying, but we unlocked our first teleporter, and that's how we get around the map quickly, basically. Let's just do that. Because I want to go on to the next session as soon as possible. Activated the first portal. But we need an actual cuckoo to use that. So instead, we'll put an end to the enemy's decisive plan. Because that's a cool thing to do. Putting end to decisive plans. We need Volga for this one. Volga can easily do it though, so I'm not too worried. Defeat the Dark Impas, okay. We'll just do this until, uh, when Sans. Okay. They get weaker as they, uh... Okay. Well, if I uh, defeat the Impas, uh, that rally captain won't matter, as you just saw there. 
These missions are really easy. You can defeat the clones very quickly, and once you get it over the first time, you can just use Link or Young Link and make it even quicker. These are arguably the best missions for farming certain heroes materials in the game because they're just so quick you can do them like immediately and you get tons of materials from them usually though i have had times where i've gotten nothing from them which is never fun but this time we got two one of each which is not bad All right and um, ooh, first boss battle we need to use buy because of course we have to use our Oh, well, we can just ignore her because we have a regular setup. <laughs> and what I mean by this is we can actually use Yun Link. We have to defeat the Beast of the Jungle. We have a thousand uh, KOs to get and Tears of Light. We get uh, North Square, Eastern Tree, and Southeastern Tree. This is going to be in the Baker Tree area, isn't it? Alright. Mm, I think it'll be easier if I just kill a lot of stuff. Oh! There's lots of friends there. That might not be good. Okay. Oh, we're facing off against the same opponent who helped us out before. Okay, uh, Link, I'm gonna send you over here to Southeast Tree, which is required. And Yun Link is gonna go towards this area. And I will use Phi to take out this first one. Oh, we have to extort the messengers, so that's what we have to do. Hmm. For extorting the messenger, I'm gonna just use you for the first one. So we'll take that keep out and then KO this Dynafloss. Now, since I do have a lot of damage, I can use Phi. She's just weaker than my other characters, so it takes longer to KO stuff, but... At this point, we basically need all out we can get. Okay. Pretty soon, when I get his er, er, level 2 weapon, this is going to be a lot easier. So, we need Southeast Tree as well. Uh, can I please uh, KO this other guy really quick so that um, the messenger... Oh. <laughs> I kind of like look at that and the messenger's already at the base. He is really quick. Okay, so a stall is all I needed. Now we have to very quickly clear out all these keeps. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I'm, yeah, I'm capturing them immediately. Mister. Oh, and yes, I do have a new... Uh, costume. This one is based off of the classic Link costume. What in the world? This keep is taking forever to capture. I think it has higher uh, a capture rate than any art keep in the game. And there we go. <laughs> Jeez Elise. I've, and I fought the keep sad more elf. <laughs> so when, you, when they fortify a keep, they basically make it even worser. Okay. Okay, good. Okay, we need to kill these Dinofloss. Alright. This should take care of messenger number two. Safely. Now we need Eastern Tree, which is... All the way over here. And, oh, yeah. Eastern T. Oh, wait, this is our uh, boss key. Okay, so this is Eastern Tree. I need the pot, unless I already got it. Okay, here it is. There's our food. We do have to get all food at least once. I'm gonna use you to take this keep. Uh... This is not the keep I want, but I will still take it. Okay, good. We have our reinforcements, so that takes care of that problem. Whoa, there's a big boy here. 
let's uh, take care of this baddie. And then very quickly defeats the summoner to remove the Dark Dark Nut. Which we did really quickly this time. We need North Square now, which is all the way on top and Lana's in danger somehow. I don't know how. Oh, yeah, that's right. There's Dinoplast back here. I almost forgot about them. <laughs> I hadn't really gotten the chance to kill them and somehow Young Link is down quite a bit of health. Thankfully, when you take damage on the offside, it doesn't seem to add to your counter, which is good. Because I think those strong characters that I left when I sent Yun Lake out, he wants like straight into the forces, so that's why he's so low for some weird reason. Oh, see, look, Lana also has a stat now. This is weird. This is really weird, but it is what it is. Okay. Took all the keeps down. All right. Now we need the fairy direction, fairy decoration, rather, from North Square or. Actually, no, this is a hard container, and it's 4-5. Whoops. I just found that out, too. Well, he is, she is now going to come all the way up to North Square, and I'm just going to kill the commander with Yun Link to summon the boss, and then hopefully I can get the other thing as soon as possible. Okay, we have this boss key. Let's go straight to the boss. Thankfully, we only have to do this one once. Thanks to that stuff. They're using the wrong weapons, I think. I think this is what makes Twilight Map so mixed up. Is they just use different weapons for some reason here. Okay. There's our heart attainer for Phi, and that takes care of all the treasures in this map. We did it pretty quickly. Now we just have to kill this go mode real quick. Okay. That was rather entertaining. <laughs> okay. Oh, you say you see ya. Alright. Okay, uh... That was that. So now we got the teardrop item. So somehow we got all of that. You know, encounter special Twilight Rolls and battles taking place. Here Twilight from a map server by using a Tears of Light I am card. What is this? No special attacks. Oh. I think I can do it. I think this is the switch, right? Yeah, so we put that on there and that unlocks in our ability. Recoup more allies and overwhelm the enemy. Limited Lana. Lana doing a lot of stuff today. Maybe this is- maybe Tri Princess is actually where Lana's from, I don't know. 
Nobody really knows, truly. Let's get uh, a lightning fire recommended is one of those, so we'll just quickly uh, I'll just get both of them. That uh takes care of that. Oh, okay, we can use more characters. Oh yeah, so the try is apparently really dangerous. All right, uh, we're gonna use her with Young Link and Link. Lana is actually a character I wanted to use on this mission anyway, though, so that makes sense, I guess. Uh, so she needs to go to the East Temple ASAP. And we, but first we have to recruit allies, so we need to figure out what that's about. First. Whoa. There we go. Here we go. Now we're in it. Capture all barrier keeps. Nice. Very quick uh, and easy change to rescue the fairies here. Oh, excuse me, stop dodging around, Mr. Lesson, so I can hit you. I'm gonna come to him after I do some other stuff. And I don't care about these barrier keeps enough, we'll just, uh, kill them normally, I think. This is faster to just skip, uh, the characters there. Barrier specialist. The West Temple will fall. Oh boy. It's great. Uh, we need to deal him fairly quick. And yes, I am trying to capture the keeps. <laughs> it's not easy to do. Okay, cool. All right. Oh, King Bulvin's back. So just like in uh, Twilight Princess, King Bulvin will appear a ton. Uh, it's just ridiculous. Okay, good. Recruited him. Oh, that's East Temple. Lana has to go there. Oh, threat. Lana, you're gonna go to East Temple. Young Link's gonna go for here. West Ruins. Alright, good.
Okay, good. Okay, good. Good. Okay. Jeez, I keep thinking that's my uh, uh, opponent, but I know it's rogue forces. I always forget about that. Okay. Here's our uh, one and only hunted container here. And, oh, I still need the Skulltula. That is also important uh, to know that we need the Skulltula. And I believe I have a thousand kills, but it just hasn't been spawning yet. Oh, okay. Lana's closer to it. We're going to use Lana to go to that really quick. Probably in the dead end or something. I just saw this now. It might have spawn too early for me, who knows. Nope, got it. Thank goodness. Please, you're trying to hit me so quickly, though. Got him. Apparently I got a material and weapon for him. I didn't know that could happen. Potentially. Now a lot of these ones with skull tools on them, I'm just doing it uh, once to get the thing over with, but not getting the second skull to it until much later. Oh wow, the that second one's literally the same thing, except now I have to kill 1,200 enemies overall. Which means you just kill everybody <laughs> that comes near you. Standard outfit for Twilight Lana. Okay, this is quick enough. By the way, where is that Twilight? Where's our uh, Twilight maps? I thought this would have a lot of them, but clearly not. The thing I hate about, like, sometimes is not necessarily hating him normally, is the fact that when he, sometimes he can take no damage, supposedly, and sometimes his effects will be, X of his Master Sword will just disappear for quite a bit. I don't know what happens, but it's kind of annoying. I don't like it.
Okay. Took out the Dark Impa. Now we have to hey oh the enemies up here. Ah, of course. Wait until he's dead to use that item. Oh, there's a Goma here, too. Well, I don't want to deal with Goma. The Goma will probably uh, break my beams if I um, ever do that. So we're just going to do this instead. I need a lot of Dark Nut Swords as well, so we're ailing enemies here to make that happen. Alright, got the lot of animation error, but... Here's the mission, at least. Nice. Yeah. Now that I've gotten this, uh, uh, and all the maps, uh, played at least once, I can farm them. That's part of the only reason why I'm doing this, so. Expect multiple things to happen. Ooh, we have a lantern. Uh, this is actually quick enough. Right? Let's team up and defeat the enemy forces. Yeah, it's a hard continue from doing it. We're just gonna go and use her. Right now. Now, this is supposed to be the third map in the entire game. This is where, like, a lot of all three weapons could come from normally. But, uh. If. It, uh, since this is not the Wii U version, things are different. Who do we have? Oh, great. We have choices between uh, Volga and Rizro. Guess who I'm picking? Not Rizro, because uh, Rizro, uh, I still need a lot of his materials, so we're uh, making him our opponent here. Uh, the second character, I usually, uh, don't emulate pet, so if I don't know where it is, I kind of just guess where I think the commander is going to be and just, uh, kale them there. These would probably be the more obnoxious thought, so... <laughs> just threw a giant bomb at it. Oh, okay, cool. Th I'm killing Sheik. I want to take out Sheik because he's another one of the materials that I absolutely need. So Sheik is going to die whether she wants to or not. Okay, and we get Lana as our ally, which is not bad. We have... Out of stuff. All right, that takes care of that. Oh, we are facing the Gorods. I just realized. Gorods make the weirdest noises when they get hit and die. It's kind of awkward, actually. It makes some people sad. That's for sure. But I'm not gonna say anything else. Where is this commander? Oh, okay. All right, so. I'm guessing he's probably gonna be like here or down right. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Spawned right into that. Oh, Sheik is cloned. Sheik just cloned himself. Look at that. He didn't just like turn into our stuff. He straight up turned to the dark side. <laughs> Sheik now has a buddy in the form of Dark Sheik. That's actually good because I can get two materials from them instead of one. So I will have to remember this mission because this is a very good Sheik Farmy mission. And I need a lot of Sheik materials for, I think, either Lana? Yeah, it's Lana that needs a lot of Sheik materials. Well, obviously, since there's a Dark Sheik here, I want to defeat it too. Oh, she is all the... Hey, and the... Uh, Aerofosses just done everywhere. Meanwhile, our commanders are... 
kind of just busy by your side. You shall not be my ally, Sheik, because I already killed you. <laughs> oh, we still need to kill this guy. Oh, someone's fleeing. That might be bad for our other. Whoa, jeez. Excuse me. That that's completely stunned. That move completely stunned me. That's a bit annoying. Okay, I don't even see where he died, but that's a bit concerning. Okay, just killing all the captains right now. I need to protect both of my commanders. If they die, uh, things are gonna happen. Excuse me, Yango. You gonna do something? And he did the not fire breath. In a uh, Wii U version, he could sometimes do this and not uh, actually uh, open his mouth sometimes. It's kind of trolly. So often, the best way to get, defeat King Donald and Wii U is you needed a special for him. Like, not just special, like straight up magic. And then you had to use the magic to actually uh, attack him. And that was like your only really good way of defeating him. Though I didn't really see much, because I finally remembered when I played him, he almost always opened his mouth. But uh, I guess that is different between the different people. And I'm turned around the one way. Okay, let's uh go magic against uh Ezra so we can uh kill him quicker. Okay good, we got his extra experience while we were in magic form and he dropped a gold and Silver material, that's nice. <laughs> he kind of just. I keep forgetting that Duridia turns big whenever he uh, does other stuff. <laughs> Alright. Excellent work, everyone. And that's going to be the end of the video now. Since this is unique, we get to just watch and hear Serious on yet again. This is definitely one of the best songs in um, Akria time as a whole, if you ever see this. And yes, in case you are wondering, you do have to play it for Darunia during Ocarina of Time, and this is the dance he basically does when you uh, uh, play it to him for the first time. It's really funny. It's like one of the best parts of Ocarina of Time as a whole. We got another new item. Oh, jeez, we got five kunais from Sheik there. That will take care of a lot of our material problems we've been having lately. Okay, so the closest Ikiku that isn't in, like, a bad spot is down here. So that's where we're gonna go. Oh, I just noticed. So anything that just has a square surrounding it like that, that's Twilight. So that we have to dispel. And we can't uh, actually collect the Tears of Light except from those items. So we have to collect those and then use those to dispel the Twilight to go further. Yeah, so anyways, I'll see you guys in the next video. And until then, see you uh, I like you guys enjoyed this. Cut, rate, subscribe, and I'll see you guys later. Bye.